In this tutorial in PhotoDirector 365, we're going to show you how to use the Red Eye Removal Tool. To get to it, you need to be on your Adjustment button in the upper left corner. And then it's a component of the Regional Adjustment Tools. I'll click the arrow to enlarge that. It's the third of seven tools. The third tab from the left, I'll click on there. Before I use the tool, I want to magnify that area. I'm going to click on the Zoom tool in the upper left corner and we'll define the area we want to zoom into and now we have her eyes. Technically this isn't a red eye issue, it's more of a glare issue, but we can use it here as well. I have to uncheck the magnifying glass or I won't have the right icon. Now I'm back to the icon that the red eye removal tool uses. I'm going to click in the area where it would be a red eye but here it's lighter. It can't find it, that's okay. It inserts a little black area and I can change the size of the pupil by using the slider or I can change it also if I want to by using the mouse and clicking on the circle. Let's click the other one over here. It can't find it there either. This happens to be an oval in this case so we'll make it round again and then we'll change the size down and move the location to about where we want it. Maybe a little bit smaller in this case. Okay, so now I have that one taken care of. When I'm happy, I'm going to click Done or I can click Reset to start over. And let's look at a before and after. And now I've changed it to see her shoulders and her head. And so you see how her eyes are a little bit more attractive without the, the white glare bouncing off the camera image. We have other things we'd like to change in this photograph and we'll deal with those in the next tutorial when we look at some of the adjusted brush and adjusted brush selection tools.